the glory of God. And we as Christians need to live that way. That God is to be praised and to be honored and to give glory to Him. But you know what? How do you do that? Just by worshiping and singing songs and say, praise you, God. But you know what's more important than our speech? Is to know that true peace comes with a relationship. Because that's how God designed each and every one of us, to have a relationship with Him. That's His whole plan from the very beginning, before the world began, before creation. He wants to have a relationship with each and every one of us. And in order to have true peace, we must have this relationship between Jesus and ourselves. Completeness, right? So many people out there are seeking solutions to be at peace with themselves, and they're looking at the wrong place. Just like you probably heard it said that, that God created a void in our spirit, right? In our self. That only one thing, it was, that spot was created there for only one thing to fulfill. And we try to put all kinds of stuff in that hole to, to fulfill us. Some people use drugs or alcohol. They think that by putting that stuff in that they're going to be happy. Some people search for relationships thinking that a person is going to make them happy. You know what? God intended that one place in us for only Himself. And His plan was that when you submit to Jesus Christ as your Lord and your Savior, you will be filled. Filled with what? Filled with His Holy Spirit. God intended from the very beginning to live within you. And when you have the Heavenly Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit dwelling in you, then you are complete. And when you are complete and you have harmony with the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, then you will have peace. Then you will experience true peace. Yet it's so sad that so many people are seeking peace from everywhere else except from the source of peace, the Prince of Peace. And so again, the only way anyone can experience true peace is when he becomes complete with God's design and plan to be united in a harmonious relationship with him. One cannot overlook the fact that this harmony will never happen until man has a right relationship Shalom, with Yahweh. And it will be the result of the righteous rule of the shoot from the stump of Jesse, who has upon him the spirit of Yahweh. He is the Prince of Peace. The hymn of invitation today is Heaven King thou, and glory filled my soul. You understand what that really means? Is when we allow God to come down, not just come down to the earth, which he has done, but to allow him to come and live within us and give us the peace that we all desire. Let's all stand and sing together.